Hello everybody, welcome to the Wonky Angle, where I talk about electronic music, both new and old. And today I'm talking about the new EP from Sounds from the Ground, Rhythm and Reason. Sounds from the Ground are the English down-tempo duo consisting of Nick Wolfson and Elliot Morgan Jones, also one of my personal favorite bands of all time. I've been keeping up with them for several years, and I've not seen a band that is quite so reliable. They've been putting out albums every couple of years, and so far, every single one of them has been great. With 11 main albums out so far, and I don't think I'd rate a single one of them lower than an 8 out of 10. Well, I suppose there is Through the Ages, but that's an outtakes collection, I don't count that. While their last couple of albums since Wider World in 2012 each took quite a while to grow on me, I haven't seen a band that has so consistently impressed me with each successive release. Each one with its own separate identity and overall sound, but still retaining their definitive style of chilled out dub techno, making for a band that could come in for nearly endless repeat listens. They may not have any particular album that was super amazing and everybody considers a classic or whatever, though I do hold a mosaic and luminal quite close to my heart, but the fact that they've been going on such a long time with no dip in quality is truly amazing. This release here, though, is quite obviously not an album. Now, uh, while SFTG's EP lineup is not quite as impressive as their album lineup, this one being only their fourth, and to be honest, I don't find them all great, uh, but I do still like them all. First there was In the Cool of the Shade in 2009, which was good at the time, but admittedly is no longer particularly worth your time, thanks to two of the tracks from here being included on their Ready Steady Slow album. Then there was Spectral EP in 2010, still great, probably my personal favorite, and then Tonic Radio EP in 2011. So this one here, Rhythm and Reason, would be their first EP in five years. And, well, though I don't like this new EP as much as Spectral, at least not yet, SFTG have delivered yet again with three new solid tracks. Before the Storm is kinda like this kind of psychedelic soundscape with lots of guitar sounds floating around, warm pads, and cutting synth basses. Fascinating song to be sure. To be honest, I don't think I've particularly heard uh, SFTG make something that sounded quite like this before. Pretty awesome. Stofi Tiki is probably my least favorite of the three, but still a pretty cool track, mostly focusing around darker and more abstract ambient passages, much like the material found on their 2010 album The Maze, definitely has that more mysterious edge to it. And finally, Would Be King starts out with a really mysterious and atonal ambient intro, but about a minute in, slips into some more comfortable territory, reminding me of some of their older stuff, like Mosaic. Or if we want to use the EPs for comparison, it actually kind of sounds like the stuff on Spectral, too. As much as I like it whenever SFTG push their sound into new boundaries, I'm a total sucker for that old, smoother sound that characterized their earlier albums. And this track is probably my favorite in this bunch. So overall, while it didn't offer that much surprises, I'm game for basically anything these guys have to offer. And granted, no SFTG release ever has, like, been, like, mind-blowingly amazing on first listen. So maybe this will grow on me and go beyond Spectral in a year or so, so, so who knows. But it's always a pleasure to hear anything new from SFTG no matter how small the offering. Excited for the inevitable 12th album and whatever sounds that will turn out, this was definitely something nice to tide me over in the meantime. I'm overall feeling a 7.7 .7 out of 10, but of course this is just my opinion, you can feel free to disagree with it, but I would like to hear your thoughts, so leave the comments in the comment thing down there. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all for today. See you next time.